When this film was released, it was actually banned in the state of New York for excessive violence and immorality, specifically Kitty Ganning murder with the ice pick. Well, after a few strategic cuts, approval was given for the film to be shown, at least in New York. But even with the changes, other cities across the country banned the film altogether. Universal Pictures and Diana Production Company eventually sued the city of Atlanta, in fact, claiming that the censors there did not have the authority to ban the movie on the grounds it did. Well, a few months later, after considerable wrangling, the film was okayed for showing in September of 1946, by which time the publicity was so intense, the movie drew huge crowds wherever it was shown. Now, Joan Bennett was 35 when she made Scarlet Street. She was 80 when she died in 1990, her career one of the longest in Hollywood's history books. Her last big success being a co-starring role in the daytime TV vampire series, Dark Shadows. Up next, something very different. It's a totally wacky comedy made by the Brits back when they dominated the field of movie comedy. It's a movie that stars include Terry Thomas hitting the daffiest group of burglars to strap on guns without a clue as to how to shoot one. Tonight on Turner Classic Movies, Robert Osborne's picks continue with Make Mine Mink. Then Angela Lansbury pulls the emergency break in The Harvey Girls. And Jose Ferrer settles the scores throughout Deep in My Heart.